Good afternoon, everyone. I welcome you all in Agribusiness Series 3 to know more about the industry directly from the industry expert. On behalf of ISP, I'm Shweta, Training and Placement Officer. I welcome you all. And just starting with a quick brief introduction about Imperial School of Agribusiness. Uh, Imperial School of Agribusiness is the child of uh, director and co-founder Mr. Saurav K. Pandey, who is uh, I'm Ahmedabad alumnus with the vision to encourage and nurture excellence in the field of food and agribusiness management. I have secured eighth rank among top ABM Institute in India for exposure and uh, placements, ISP bridge gap between the industry and youth who want to establish career in the field of agriculture by providing them formal, informal and non-formal education. So today's back to the series, and today is a special and uh, today honorable excellency is Mr. Ganesh Karchit, who is uh, leading the uh, human resource department at SWAL. So this is the favorite, you know, uh, I think vertical where the student would have lots of queries, uh, you know, they have framed questions. Be before starting, I would like to give brief introduction about sir. He is leading the human resource function at SWAL being the part of leadership team partnering with the business of to drive revenue generation through distribution sales in the agri input sector, focus on developing talent from within, skills enhancement, capacity building, leading to higher productivity, driving learning and development initiative aligned with the business plan and vision of the organization. As the part of this world leadership team, he is responsible for hiding the best talent also responsible for driving talent strategy with the strong focus on talent management planning ta ta talent branding so uh, hopefully like after two years you people can be also one of the uh, you know part of student can all be all the part of this organization and uh, now i would request uh, Mr. Ganesh Kathir, sir, to kindly take over and uh, let us know more about his journey in the agri input sector. Over to you, sir. Great, great. Thank you, Shweta. Thanks, uh, and good afternoon, everyone. And thank you for uh, you know getting me online to you know interact with the number of students uh, from the institute or who are planning to join the institute. I would say. So, uh, guys, uh, if uh, can you briefly tell me, you are currently pursuing your last year of uh, agri uh, BSc agri, is it correct? Okay, yes. great, great, great. And I'm sure. Uh, you might be having a lot of uh, you know questions on what uh, you must be taking up as your career or what has MBA in agribusiness management got in for you once you get into this and uh, after two years of uh, this journey, what you will end ending up doing. So, you know, uh, there, are, there will be a lot of myths that you must be encountering. There will be a lot of, you know, uh, suggestions or inputs that you might be receiving from n number of people outside because uh, in India, we I, I guess, you know, uh, Everybody is so habituated to give, you know, advices. आपने तो advice सबसे सुनी होगी ये कर ले बेटा, वो कर ले बेटा, यहाँ यहाँ admission लेगा तो तुम्हारे साथ ये होगा, अच्छा होगा. You know, there are lot of inputs I'm sure you are getting and you are already confused about it. And that is where I want to come and speak to you. Although it's a smaller population, my my duty to tell you is that you know, जो भी आप यहाँ से थोड़ा बहुत ज्ञान लेके जाओगे और अपने friends लोगों को भी बताओ. Okay. If you are planning to take up MBA agriculture, okay. This is the probably best decision if you have taken after completing your BSc degree. The amount of opportunities that open up for you after completing MBA at uh, Agri Business Management are immense. Like you know, uh, it has been uh, what ten to eleven months I have joined this setup. Okay, earlier I was uh, part of a real estate organization, so that I was in to a startup. So I have seen. Uh, uh, you know, kind of uh, management trainees coming in from various different sectors and various different kind of organizations. And since the time I have joined this uh, agri input sector organization, I have seen, I I had little idea about the M MBA in agri business management. Also, such kind of course exists and what does it deliver? Now, once I've joined here and I have started interacting with these students and as well as various institutes, the Opportunities that we also as an organization offer and the opportunities which are available in the market outside for people who are completing MBA agribusiness management are immense. To speak specifically only about the agri input sector, the kind of business we are into. We are into purely an we are into crop protection business. Okay. 
it's an agrochemical setup wherein we provide all the inputs which are required for a farmer to you know increase their yield protect themselves from various herbicides for, for, uh, yeah, protect themselves from uh, various uh, you know in- insects uh, pesticides pests and all those things and that is where you know this this market in india of agrochemicals is more than 40000 crores more than 40000 crores and we as an organization upl are contributing is contributing to say 4% 10% of it that is a 4000 crore of business 4 to 5000 crore of business so you can can you imagine the potential that this market has got and there are other competitors like say bayer life sciences godrej agrovet then you have sumitomo chemicals fmc uh then you have uh, best agro so there are so many you know competitors that we have and they have their into similar kind of business model right now and that is where the opportunities for you as they come up like you know once you get into mba agri business management after one year aap log of the six months or uh, six months uh, sorry after one uh, one year two semesters you go for two months of summer internship tab aapko jaake various जो रोल्स होते हैं वो आपको पता चलेगा सो मेनली आप देखोगे एग्रोकेमिकल्स इंडस्ट्री में रोल्स आर इनटू सेल्स एंड मार्केटिंग इनिशियली व्हेन यू स्टार्ट योर करियर ओके सेल्स एंड मार्केटिंग इतना क्लोजली निट है ओके okay? इसमें ज्यादा इतना फर्क नहीं है बट मार्केटिंग जो है इट वर्क एक्सक्लूसिवली ऑन द डिमांड जनरेशन एक्टिविटी मान लीजिए जैसे हमारे पास में अगर एक सिक्सटी सेवेंटी प्रोडक्ट्स का एक रेंज है बट उस प्रोडक्ट्स जैसे उसमें ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इंसेक्टिसाइड्स होंगे कुछ पेस्टिसाइड्स होंगे कुछ फंजी साइट्स होंगे अब इसके बारे में फार्मर के साथ में आप अवेयरनेस कैसे जनरेट करोगे दैट इज मार्केटिंग फंक्शन ओके उस मार्केटिंग फंक्शन जो डिमांड जनरेट करेगा उसका सेल्स एंश्योर करना है फ्रॉम द डीलर्स फ्रॉम द रिटेलर्स एंड एंश्योरिंग दैट यू नो एट वेरियस एवरी प्लेटफॉर्म वेर एवर प्रोडक्ट कैन बी सोल्ड विच इज गोइंग टू रेवेन्यू जनरेट रेवेन्यू वो रेवेन्यू जनरेशन इज टेकन केयर बाई दी सेल्स फंक्शन में ओके so normally how majorly the sales and marketing functions mein ye wale roles involved hote hain so demand generation activities mein kya hoga ki when you are there as a you may, may join as a farm advisor you may join as a territory development officer you may join as a join as a project officer in these roles what you actually end up doing is you may be connecting with farmers doing various kind of farmer meetings you might end up doing field demos jahan pe aap एक फील्ड में जाते हैं उसमें से अगर आपके पास में हाफ एकर प्लॉट है उसमें से आप दो कैरियो में दो जो एप्लीकेशन फार्मर खुद करता है वो करेंगे बाकी दो कैरियो में जो आपका जो प्रोडक्ट है डेमो प्रोडक्ट वो आप देखा लगाएंगे आफ्टर टेन डेज यू विल सी द रिजल्ट नंबर ऑफ डेज वॉट आई टॉकिंग इज टेंटेटिव इन नेचर डिपेंडिंग ऑन वॉट कैंड ऑफ एप्लीकेशन वॉट कैंड ऑफ क्रॉप वी आर टॉकिंग ऑफ ओके उतना टेक्निकल नॉलेज मुझे नहीं है बिकॉज आई एक्चुअली डो नॉट है बी एस सी एग्री बैकग्राउंड तो आप उतना मुझे एक्सक्यूज करो इफ आई गिव यू सम आई एम ट्राइंग टू बिल्ड अ पिक्चर इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू कि एक्टिविटीज क्या होते हैं सो इन दैट फील्ड डेमो आप करेंगे यू विल इनवाइट ऑल दीज फार्मर्स और देयर इन्फ्लुएंसर फार्मर्स और देयर एंड यू विल शो देम दैट दीज आर द रिजल्ट्स दैट इज वेयर यू नो व्हेन दे सी द रिजल्ट्स दे विल गेट मोटिवेटेड टू यू नो यूज योर प्रोडक्ट दैट इज वेयर द डीलर कनेक्ट विल कम नाउ दिस इज द डीलर दिस इज वेयर द प्रोडक्ट्स आर अवेलेबल एंड दैट इज वेयर दिस कस्टमर बेस व्हिच यू हैव एंगेज्ड by giving them a product demo they will go and connect with the dealer and do the sales do the buying from there that is where our sales is taken care of so this is how you know the sales and marketing go very closely hand in hand okay in an agro in agri input sector organization okay now aap jaise aapka career shuru hota hai you will join as like farm advisor roles hai fir baad mein territory development project officer then you join also in sales as a territory sales officer then a territory sales manager ठीक है अब इसमें ये बात एग्री इनपुट सेक्टर की बहुत ही लाजवाब ये है कि आप कुछ एक्सपीरियंस सेल्स में लेने के बाद आप मार्केटिंग में भी मूव हो सकते हो कुछ एक्सपीरियंस आप मार्केटिंग से लेने के बाद आप सेल्स में भी मूव कर सकते हो इतना क्लोजली नेट होने की वजह से यू हैव एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ बोथ द सेक्टर्स एंड वंस यू हैव द एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ बोथ द सेक्टर इट इज वेरी इजी टू ग्रो अप इन योर करियर ऑल्सो सो नॉर्मली वेन आप सेल्स में टेरिटरी सेल्स मैनेजर के रोल में जब स्टार्ट करते हो तो आपको एक टेरिटरी का एक इंचार्ज बनाया जाता है नॉर्मली आपका टेरिटरी का टारगेट होगा फाइव टू सेवन क्रोस का बिजनेस आपको एक साल में जनरेट करना होता है तो वो टेरिटरी है जैसे आपकी कोई डिस्ट्रिक्ट होगा आपके अंदर दैट एंटायर डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑलरेडी डीलर्स और वेर यू बिल्ड अ कनेक्ट विद दम द मार्केटिंग टीम विल बी विथ यू हु डिमांड जनरेशन एक्टिविटी सपोर्ट 
तो पूरे वो डिस्ट्रिक्ट में दैट मार्केटिंग टीम विल बी कंडक्टिंग ऑल द वेरियस डिमांड जनरेशन एक्टिविटीज लाइक फील्ड डेमो फार्मर मीटिंग एंड ऑल दोज थिंग्स एंड दैट इज वेर यू नो वेन द डिमांड इज जनरेटेड द सेल्स विल हैपन एंड यू हैव टू एंश्योर इट सो इट्स लाइक यू नो इन द बिगिनिंग ऑफ योर करियर इट सेल्फ यू गेट अ पीपल मैनेजमेंट काइंड ऑफ अ रोल यू विल बी हैविंग some third party resources who are working under you okay they will be you know conducting those demand generation field activities farmer activities you will be able to track those activities and that is how you are responsible for the entire territory that district or two district that come under you from where you will be generating the revenue okay so that's how the initial career your your career starts in a agri input sector organization then after some time when you are really performing well okay then either you might want to you know take an experience into marketing you move to a field marketing manager kind of a role wherein you take up take under you know two to three territories aur wahan pe wo aap marketing activities conduct karne ki aapki responsibility hoti hai so you will have again have a team then there will be two three territory managers with whom you will be closely working for demand generation activities and that is how the marketing support will be extended then when you are also doing well in sales like today you started with a 5 crore 7 crore 10 crore territory when you are very much eligible I think there is some network issue. Yes, sir. Uh, I think there no, is. No, no, I I got a call. I got a call. I had to answer the call. I'm so sorry. Okay. No. Can you hear me? Yeah. So when you are uh, when you start taking up when you have gained much good amount of experience. Okay. Now now is the time you start taking control of a larger region. आप पहले territory sales manager से आपने शुरू किया था. सिमिलरली आपने जैसे बैंकिंग वगैरह में भी सुने होंगे या एफ सेक्टर में भी सुना होगा कि एक टेरिटरी सेल्स मैनेजर होता है फिर एक रीजनल मैनेजर होता है फिर एक जोनल मैनेजर होता है फिर एक जोनल हेड होता है सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ रोल्स डू एग्जिस्ट इन द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन सेल्स मॉडल हियर एन एग्री इनपुट सेक्टर सो नेक्स्ट रोल फॉर टेरिटरी सेल्स मैनेजर फॉर पीपल हुर कमिंग फ्रॉम प्रीमियम स्कूल हुर वेरी गुड विद देयर यू नो नॉलेज अबाउट सेल्स एंड मार्केटिंग फॉर गुड विद देयर फाइनेंस गुड विद देयर नंबर द नेक्स्ट रोल फॉर यू रीजनल सेल्स मैनेजर वेर इन यू are almost responsible for contributing business to our 30 to 50 crores can you imagine that amount of responsibility that you are having that amount of people will be seven to eight people will be are working under you as a sales manager purvi can we mute kindly mute yourself everyone no, okay. please that's okay that's okay that's okay i'm comfortable here ye to online isme hota rehta hai so uh You know that is where, as a regional sales manager, you will have a larger responsibility to take. This may, you have to, काफी कुछ uh, interesting इसलिए हो जाता है because similar kind of work your competition is also doing. So it's like you will have three four competitors in the same market. They are also you know con- con- contributing to similar kind of uh, you know products in the market. So how your product is differentiated than the competition, making customers slash farmers aware about it is a bigger challenge. and that is where you know once you strike that you know chord with the farmer and they have understood that you know how your product differentiates from the competition and how it is going to add value to them see basically our job in the agri input sector whatever it is beat our competition or anyone our basic purpose our moral purpose is to increase the yield and revenue of farm okay at any point of time agar hum unko is cheez ke liye agar हेल्प करेंगे तभी जाके एक फार्मर भी मोटिवेट होगा हमारे साथ में काम करने के लिए ओके एंड आई एम श्योर यू गाइस वेरी वेल नो द एग्रीकल्चर एज एन एज एन इंडस्ट्री बिकॉज फोर इयर्स यू हैव क्लोजली यू नो यू नो स्टडीड दैट वर्क ऑन इट यू हैव प्रैक्टिकली अप्लाइड दोस लर्निंग सो यू नो हाउ वॉट काइंड ऑफ चैलेंजेस अ फार्मर फेस में भी आप दे होंगे सिक्स मंथ और समथिंग यू स्पेंड विथ द फार्मर्स ओके चैलेंजेस आपने देखे होंगे ओके लाइक मैं चैलेंजेस तभी आइडेंटिफाई कर पाया जब मैंने ये ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ज्वाइन करी इवन दो आई कम फ्रॉम माय माय पेरेंट मामा जी एंड ऑल दे डू हैव फार्मर इन फार्मिंग एंड ऑल दैट बट वो चैलेंजेस तभी मैं अपने आंखों से देख पाया जब मैन आई गॉट इनटू दिस इंडस्ट्री 
you have seen it very closely for four years and you are much closer to that industry so that is where you know this agri in uh, agri business management helps you to shape up your career now i will just give you a gist of what is the agri input sector there are so many other organizations okay like uh, now there are take the example of banks okay now in banks also okay for uh, the agri loan uh, 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 which is there available for farmers for that also the relationship manager roles are also hired from mba mba agri business management students only so a lot of banks okay not all the nationalized banks and all the other private banks who have their branches in all these towns villages and district places wherever there is they have a farmer as their customer they do have this relationship manager for agri agri business loans okay and that is where this career also comes into picture for you because you first thing you understand the farming then you understand farming as a business and how you know what kind of customer you have everything you know now only you have to understand the how the banking uh, activities work and what all uh, products bank can offer to the farmer as a customer and that is where you are again involved there as a relationship manager for all the farmer and the customers that come up to you this is one of the very much you know secretive career that uh, again you can see from apart from you know working into the agri input sector nowadays lot of startups have come into the industry okay now there are there are organizations like the heart is there then there are uh, even we also have something related to technology called nurture.com so wherein we work on you know getting the farmers on an online platform where we are able to provide them all the sustainable agri solutions in terms of right from you know use of agrochemicals we are giving them all the inputs on the uh, weather forecast we are also helping them you know if you are uh, sowing something what are the applications that you should take up what will be beneficial for you know them to increase the yield such kind of advisory uh, and consulting solutions also we have you know started providing so there are immense opportunities which comes with this kind of education plus you have a greater understanding on the service aspect marketing aspect finance a learning that you get which normally when you are doing your undergraduate course these learnings do not come like you know understanding a balance sheet of an organization how does a sales impact the organization what is the revenue generation how 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 is revenue more important for an organization no organization is doing a charity but you know doing the business how how the new leads how the revenue generated what is the contribution what profits are we earning how are we utilizing the profits all these learning that you get once you are into a b school plus also being into a b school what happens is that you know you get shaped onto the uh, skills like leadership okay how to work in a team how to manage your time there are so many not you know learn by just like that because, but because you have to be in that environment you have to be in that kind of setup you have to uh, get through those kind of curriculum theoretical as well as you know case studies that you'll be undergoing that amount of experience that you get in a in a in a b school is you know totally unparalleled and cannot be you know uh, uh, you you might get it while you start just uh, working after bsc agri also but the thing is that the growth that a b school graduate will have and an undergraduate will have there will be a difference so if there is time and you can think of it taking up a new course and you know you can you can see a, a value getting added to you in your career i'm sure you know uh, mba agree business management opens up an immense amount of avenues for you and i i actually have started seeing it and we definitely you know we we also have started hiring people recently for the campus engagement programs and all that uh, and that's where uh, you know uh, people have come these are the management trainees have joined they have started on their career even the first, there is a management trainee who has within the first month has clocked in his what five to six amount of lakhs of uh, sales also so i'm sure uh, you also will be able to be successful in your career as you move forward and take up these uh, challenges going forward that's it from my end uh, just to brief you about how you will be able to shape up your career with you know uh, a b school degree in your hand and i'm sure uh, if you have any questions or something related to whatever what we spoke or anything which is not even related you want to ask any random question open to it let me know shoot how much ever i will be able to answer i'll answer it yes please thank you so very much sir for uh, giving the complete insight about the roles and responsibility 
and how they can do good uh, knowing the complete details uh, you know information now we request yeah. for the question please if you have uh, uh, you know questions you can directly ask one by one good afternoon sir hey good afternoon tell me nikhilesh this side sir i want to ask uh, as you told earlier like you are connecting with the farmers for the trial and uh, something so how you communicate with them uh, the interaction how much difficult it is connecting with the farmers see when we go to a, any 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 say the territory manager uh, of a territory will have will know his the territory completely there might be some 10 15 villages okay you have to you know keep the connect by you know you'll have a farm advisor who will be working with you a farm advisor will be handling at least 3 to 4 villages okay so you will be going there doing various you know uh, uh, marketing activities like you know you're doing uh, uh, seed treatment demos you are doing okay yes. or either you know you're doing uh, in, in the evening you will be doing a farmer meeting over there so normally in the evening what happens is that you know uh, there is a milk collection at a day at any time dairies and all that there you will go there you will start speaking to the farmers you have to uh, you know uh, strike a chord with them i know first time jaoge aur fir main socho ki main aise unse directly kaise baat karu baat to shuru karni hai aapko pata hai ki woh kisan mein ke wahan pe kaun se crops abhi lage hue hain aapko wahan se topic shuru karna hai and that is how you know you initially you start with initially with few topics and that's how you you know engage them in the conversation ऐसा नहीं है कि पहले से हो नहीं रहा है और आपको बहुत एकदम नया कुछ करने जा रहा है ये चलते आ रहा हो रहा है यू जस्ट हैव टू यूज द करंट सिचुएशन एंड यू नो एंगेज विद देम एंड यू नो स्टार्ट कॉन्वर्स कॉन्वर्सेशन विद देम देन यू नो अंडरस्टैंड देयर चैलेंजेस उनके चैलेंजेस क्या है एंड देन फाइंड आउट वॉट इज द सोल्यूशन दैट यू हैव विच कैन बी ऑफर टू ओके थैंक यू एनी मोर क्वेश्चन हेलो गुड आफ्टरनून सर मैं वो पूछना चाह रहा था कि मैं आर एन डी में हूँ महाजन दीपक फर्टिलाइजर में तो उसमें दो साल दो साल ऑलरेडी हो चुके हैं मतलब मेरे को कोई ग्रोथ नहीं मिल रहा है और सभी कंपनियां जो है वो सर वो मतलब थर्ड पार्टी जॉब देती है कोई भी थर्ड पार्टी ऑन मतलब कंपनी पे रोल पे नहीं रखती है मतलब मैंने मेरे को एग्री इनपुट में थोड़ा बहुत ज्यादा इंटरेस्ट है आर एंड के अलावा तो मैंने यूपीएल भी यूपीएल भी शायद शायद नहीं पूरा हंड्रेड परसेंट वो भी थर्ड पार्टी रखती है तो उसका क्या रीजन है मतलब कि थर्ड पार्टी क्यों रखते हैं सर कंपनी में क्यों नहीं रखते डायरेक्टली दो तरीके होते हैं देखो कैसा है ना कि हम लोग अभी आप देखोगे थर्ड पार्टी में काफी सारा बड़ा वर्क फोर्स होता है ओके अभी सारे ऑन रोल नहीं आ सकते तो ऐसा होता है कि जो आप वर्क अगर थर्ड पार्टी भी ज्वाइन करते हैं उसमें कोई गलत नहीं है आप थर्ड पार्टी ज्वाइन करते हैं ठीक है उसके बाद में आप परफॉर्म करते हैं आपका परफॉर्मेंस इवेल्यूएशन होता है एंड देन यू गेट एलिवेटेड टू एन ऑन रोल जैसे अगर आप शुरू में टेरिटरी सेल्स ऑफिसर के इसमें अगर आप सेल्स ऑफिसर के रोल में आते हो जो थर्ड पार्टी पे रोल पे होता है इसमें फर्क क्या है सिर्फ पे रोल अलग अलग मैनेज होता है आपका रोल और टेरिटरी सेल्स मैनेजर का रोल तो सेम है कोई फर्क फर्क नहीं है बदलाव नहीं मोस्टली क्या होता है जो थर्ड पार्टी पे वगैरह होते हैं उनको छोटी टेरिटरीज दी जाती है क्योंकि उनका करियर वहां से शुरू हो रहा होता है पहली बार आप करने जा रहे हो आपको शुरू में अगर पांच या छह करोड़ का टारगेट देने से आप कभी शुरू शुरू में इतनी काबिलियत नहीं होती आपको भी वो कॉम्पिटेंसीज गेन करनी होती है तो मे बी यू विल स्टार्ट विद टू पॉइंट फाइव टू थ्री करोड़ इनिशियल वंस यू हैव परफॉर्म आपकी टेरिटरी पिछले साल से ज्यादा ग्रो कर गई आपका टारगेट तीन चार करोड़ का था इस साल तीन करोड़ कर लिया आपने कल अगले साल चार सवा चार साढ़े चार करोड़ कर दिया है तो आपकी जैसे कॉम्पिटेंसी आपकी बिल्ड होते जा रही है दी हायर रोल विल बी इट इज ऑलवेज लाइक सडनली आपको टेन करोड़ का टारगेट देंगे और आप उस टेरिटरी में जाएंगे और फिर आप भी अनसक्सेसफुल हो जाएंगे तो उससे आप भी डीमोटिवेट होंगे और कंपनी का भी तो नुकसान होगा दोनों तरीके के बैलेंस सो इट इज अटेपिंग स्टोन इन टू करियर इट इज नॉट दर्ड पार्टी है तो आप जिंदगी भर उसके में रहेंगे विथ योर परफॉर्मेंस यूल डेफिनेटली मूव फॉर इट इज ऑल परफॉर्मेंस बेस अगर आपको कहीं अच्छा रोल मिल रहा है तो आपको एमबीए के बाद में भी मिलता है प्लीज स्टार्ट योर करियर एवरीबॉडी इन द इंडस्ट्री हैज स्टार्टेड देयर करियर ओके थैंक यू सर यस नेक्स्ट तो यस दिस इज अ अवेलेबल यस सर आई एम दिस इज अ राजपूत 
sir i yeah. want to ask that ask that what are the more opportunity that we have as an mba after mba except marketing mm-hmm. and sales what except are, marketing and sales uh, the, yeah uh, you can you can also if you are very good with your finances you can join finance okay uh, also when you start your career in sales and marketing the other opportunity when you grow up the ladder is you can join as a uh, crop manager okay then aapko ek ek ya do particular crop ko pure ek organization ke liye manage karna hai jaise aap paddy ya sugar cane ke incharge honge so the entire paddy or sugar cane in the entire india wherever we are doing business you have to do market research aapko jo bhi hai farmer service karne hai sare insights draw karne hai and then advise the sales and marketing team that how we should strategize in moving forward with our products in these regions territories zones in and how we can increase our business so there are these crop manager roles then crop managers ke aap aage portfolio lead portfolio head aise ban these are again another you can see then there are you know business analyst kind of roles also wherein all the marketing data which is coming into the organization you will have to analyze you will have to see the various different reports aapko external benchmarking karni hai competition uh, study uh, karna hai how is our product performing versus other products and basis that you have to give insights so there are multiple opportunities that you can see if only if you are not interested in sales and marketing there are these kind of uh, roles also that exist but you have to find out which organization is hiring for that sir i also want to ask that in which field we can grow more perfectly see all the fields you can grow okay it is or everywhere you go it is individual performance okay no no where anything is going to be nobody is going to hold back your performance or anything see everything is based on your own competency and how you are performing in that role that's it it is very simple okay sir thank okay. you sir great so like for me i come from human resources but i have in my last three jobs i have changed there are three different sectors i have worked in okay so similarly you know you take whatever role you take up it is the uh, success is completely on the individual how you are performing okay and i'm sure you guys will do good any more any more questions great if there is nothing uh, that you can you ask them um number it everyone okay so like a student also sometimes as what are the things for you uh, you know you uh, check while interviewing candidate see while interviewing candidates is basically the right attitude that you are looking at okay you bsc agree you have completed two years of your course you have the basic knowledge basic understanding at least simple questions are asked in any interviews also okay the few will be tech few will be technical questions and few will be related to what are you learn in your sales and marketing and finance and all these things okay and i'm sure sales and marketing only for for an mba i did and for an mba and agri business management nothing differs okay there is one book by philip potler we all study the same book okay it's only the application differs your market is different and someone else who is doing a general mba his market is different his products are different that's the only case so only you know in an any interview wherever you go okay they are going to judge you on your confidence your spoken skills how you are able to work in a team leadership aspects and your basic knowledge about the core that you have studied that is bsc agree that's the only thing just be you know see two years of mba okay is is like in a, it's like a finishing school okay you already have the skills you know b school only sharpens all those skills which are required for you know to enter into a corporate world right so that true that thank you so very much for the answer uh so shall we move towards the, the closer student if you do yeah, have that's a question okay, you... okay. i for request of you please uh, one one last advice everyone please open a linkedin account okay have a linkedin account please connect professionally with everyone in the world okay and uh, use it to you know uh, you know create a buzz about yourself market yourself to you know showcase your complete profile over there nowadays we do everything on facebook instagram those are much much detailed profiles that every individual has my request is that you know professionally also maintain a linkedin account which is all very much necessary and build up very good professional network with everyone 
Okay. Great. That's thank you really for your time. Thanks a lot. That thank you so very much. That's a really yeah, great advice you have given. Networking is really important. Yeah. Yes, like nowadays everything is digital and people are watching you digitally. So it's really important. Yes, yes. So on behalf of entire fraternity of ISP, I would give, like to thank you for giving your precious time and if you have enlightened the complete uh, session with the, your vast knowledge, area knowledge, and with the students queries. Thank you so very much. Looking forward to have more session with you, sir. Thank you. Looking so forward. Thanks. Thank you very much. Have a thank great day. You. Take care, everyone. And please do connect. Thank on you. LinkedIn. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Bye bye.